I'm John Carlin and this is your 10 News Update. A Kentucky jury clears a former police officer of charges in the police raid that killed Breonna Taylor. Brett Hankinson had been charged with three counts of wanton endangerment for firing through sliding glass side doors and a window of Taylor's apartment during the raid. The death of Breonna Taylor along with George Floyd and Ahmaud Arbery sparked protests and demonstrations calling for change in 2020. An anti-hazing law named in memory of a VCU freshman is heading to Governor Glenn Youngkin's desk. Adams' law passed unanimously through the Virginia House and Senate. As we reported, Adam Oaks died last year from alcohol poisoning while pledging the Delta Chi fraternity. The law requires colleges to do anti-hazing training and publicly post hazing incidents reported on campus. This weekend, Ukrainians are now living in the Roanoke Valley, are rallying to show support for their native country. Saturday, they'll gather in downtown Roanoke near the library in Elmwood Park. That rally starts at 2 p.m. They encourage you to bring any posters, flags, or other items relating to the support of Ukraine. Remember, you can get updates on the go with WSLS.com and the 10 News app. I'm John Carlin, 10 News, working for you.